Hey everyone, so it's been about a month since I last spoke about my favorite looter shooter, and reading through most of the comments, I've noticed that the overall majority of people still enjoy Borderlands 2 over the other games in the franchise. Although I have my own opinions about all of them, the reason I find so much enjoyment out of a game that came out nearly a decade ago is because of its own replayability. Now again, Borderlands as a whole has an incredible track record of keeping players engaged and improving their characters, as well as making sure it's fun along the way. With RNG and overall trial and error, builds and farming can go hand in hand when it comes to making a full playthrough. But what if you don't find that fun? What then? Now my experience with the Borderlands games has been great, and truthfully I enjoy all of them. Borderlands 2 has accrued some amazing things over the years. You have DLC that pushes level caps, you have hunts that allow you to enjoy the game even after the main story has been beat. One of my favorite things to do is starting a new game with a current build and enjoying the pace of a truly hard experience. Now something I've been playing around with for the past year or so is BL2 Fix. If you're not familiar with BL2 Fix, BL2 Fix is an overhaul mod that targets the issues with Borderlands 2's loot systems, character progression, pacing, balance, and endgame. Now it targets all of these issues by carefully adjusting XP rates, loot drops, and item generation. The mod also features a plethora of quality of life improvements to give you the best Borderlands 2 experience out there. I'm going to leave the link to the mod as well as the Discord in the description box below. It's very easy to install and should be an eye opener for people who haven't given it a shot yet. Some of my favorite features within BL2 Fix is that everything is customizable. You can go in and have your own tailored experience how you see fit. And as for the gameplay, it's still Borderlands, but with a huge twist. Now you can play through the game and commit strictly to the main story because XP gains will double within true Vault Hunter mode and triple within Ultimate Vault Hunter mode. Just like in Borderlands 1, enemies who wield a higher tiered weapon can now drop them upon death. Sometimes rare spawns are a hassle to get to. And with BL2 Fix, you can hit a simple key on your keyboard, save your progress, and then load it right back up and you're there instantly again. No more treks to get your double penetrating unkempt herald. Now, I think overall that the gameplay allows for more fun to be had, rather than just relying on specific builds or weapons to keep you grounded. Now farming and side quests are completely optional with this mod too, and by that I mean you can go through the entire game all the way to OP10 just doing main quests. The XP system has been completely reworked to allow for a more smoother transition from a new playthrough as well as making sure you're not struggling too much. Now if you're me, I would still farm and occasionally do side quests anyways because this mod also allows you to re-roll for different items and weapons for a small payment of Iridium. Again, allowing you to have a different type of playthrough. I can go on and on about why this mod is incredible, but to simply just say that would be doing it a disservice. Now I'm sure most of you out there enjoy the normal game and do not want to taint that in any way. As I said before though, this mod is entirely customizable. If you don't want something added, just turn it off. I will say that playing the regular game with no cutscenes and being able to turn off dialogue as it queues up can allow you to enjoy the game at a bit of a faster pace. And I, for one, am grateful to have a mute button anytime I just want to shoot some baddies without any interruptions. This mod has a lot of credibility too, I just wish I found it sooner. Now if you'll excuse me, I have some loot to be farmed. So I'm going to catch you guys in the next one. See ya.